Well, hello and welcome, welcome back. I know it's been a long time since I posted a video here in YouTube, but it's about time for a new one. In today's video, I'm going to go over how to create an 808 slide. If this is something that you like, something that you would like to learn, please stay tuned and do not go away. <music> All right, so let's get right into this. So the first thing you do is after you open LMMS is clear or remove all of these uh, tracks that are here. So let's do that really quick. Then after you do this, you need to choose your 808. I got some 808s right here. And I got these from Surge Sound. And I'm opening them up. And I'm going to get uh, one of these 808s right here. So I'm going to get this one right here because I like it. Let's put this 808 right here. And then the first thing you need to do is open it up. So you click right here. It turns into a little uh, rectangular or square. Double click it. And it opens up the piano roll. Now it's time to place the notes. Now one other thing that I want to show you is how to place an 808. Now as you can see, I'm not going to move this tempo at all. The BPM, I'm going to leave it right there. So you click on the first one. What you do is you take this, turns into the two little arrows right here. You press and hold the left mouse button and you drag it under the two little squares. Then you place another one here, another 808 right here. You extend this one so it meets right there. Now you click on this one to copy it. And we're going to put another one with six right here. So this is what this sounds like. Now you hear that click that is kind of nasty right there. So you want to take out that click noise that it has in there. For that, you go right here and it opens this up. You click right here with the envelope filter and LFO and you click on it. Then after you click on that, you um, take the amount and bring it all the way up. You take the attack and slide it just a little bit. So now let's double click on here, open up the piano roll. Let's hear it again. And as you can hear, it doesn't have that click. Now, to get the slide on the 808, what you do is you come right up here. And this is the pitch bend mode. You click on that. And then you click wherever, wherever you want the, the pitch or the bend to go. So right now, I want it right here on this third uh, 808 note. So I click on it. And as you can see, you can see the note right here. So what you need to do is just take this, move it over to the side. All right. So it already has a dot there. You click somewhere up here and it brings the other dot. And as you can see, you can see the line right here, which is the same line that's right here. So you bring this down to whatever you want to do with it. So let's leave it right there. OK. So in order to be able to see where the note is, you need to move this over to the side. And that's one of the things that some of the guys don't teach you when they when they try to teach you how to do this uh, 808 slide. So let's take this one, it's an A, let's bring it all the way up to the A, right there. Okay, now what I'm going to do is we're going to take this one out. I'm going to take this note right here, so let's click on the pencil again. Click on this note. Actually, let's highlight it. So you click the little dotted square, you highlight it, hit and hold control, arrow up, and it brought it already up on octave, so you don't have to do it manually. Okay, then I'm going to eliminate this one right here, and we're going to add another pitch right here and we're going to bring this one all the way down so let's click right here boom let's bring it down to where this one finishes right there right there okay so you can see you put this to the side and then you'll be able where the no starts where the no ends you can do whatever you want like you can put another point here and you can bring it right up here and actually let's move this one over a bit Boom, to the side right there. So it's going to go down and it's going to go back up. Boom. All right. That's not really what I want to do, but let's listen to this 808 now. And there you have it. That's how you do an 808 slide. Actually, before I end this video, I just want to 
give a quick shout out to this young man that I saw the video on how to do the slide. His name is Vortresso Music, and he has a video out there called LMS, How to Make a Sliding 808 Bass. Um, I watched that video, and that's how I learned how to do that 808 slide that you see right here. The thing is that he didn't explain that little bit of part that I went into explaining right there, which is moving it to the side so that way you could view where your, your slide is going to be at. And then the placement of the 808, as you saw there, this is something that I learned from this other YouTuber called Bro Beats TV. He has a YouTube video out there that's called 808 Placement Simplified. And that's how I learned how to place the 808. Well, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that you learned something new from this. And I can't wait to see you on the next video.